But this is our incident command unit. Uh, it's based on a Volvo double crew cab chassis with a box back and we've taken the lessons of, of the last 20 years in designing this vehicle. So we have a, a dedicated command cell in the front and a, a crew area in the rear here. The technology we have available to us here is we have a, a, an IT platform, so all of the, all of the information that, that exists and all the situational awareness that exists at our incidents is put into our digital systems. It's displayed in dashboard format on the large screens we have around the vehicle. Being able to have large displays means that we can share a variety of sources of information at the push of a button through our Accelerate DDMI platform. And using the Accelerate DDMI platform, we're able to completely control the vehicle. We're able to have complete control over the AV matrix and display sources of information. It gives very simple one button operation for things like the mast, the satellite, and the power systems on the vehicle, which means that our operators can focus on, on getting to work as quickly as possible. So our ICU really provides a platform for our commanders to have access to the information they need to safely command the incident make sure that the situational awareness and information that we hold at an incident is shared back to other agencies and back to headquarters and back to our more senior commanders back at, uh, back at service headquarters who can have access to the information in real time and we're able to do that by the connectivity and platform that we're able to bring to the incident on this vehicle. So this incident command unit mobilises to anything over five pumps, okay, or anything that we call a level two incident. Uh, that may be a high rise, it may be a building fire that's escalated to a larger level. Uh, earlier part of this summer, before we had all the wet weather, we did actually have quite a spate of wildfires within Hampshire. Um, this vehicle was instrumental in providing uh, aerial overview and mapping information to allow our commanders uh, and our wildfire tactical advisors exactly where to direct resources at the right time. We were also able to use the digital platforms and internet connectivity to access the up-to-the-minute weather information about the optimal time to, uh, to commence firefighting. And we were able to share those plans and resources back to our wildfire advisors and our senior your offices back at headquarters as well.